Good morning, guys. Good morning. Look at your hair and get that doll doll out now. How are we all? Don't get supplying some good background music here. It's been a while since I last picked up this camera and I'm so excited to film today because there is so much to catch you up on. Obviously there's a house update I need to fill you in on. September is fast approaching and for the, I feel like this is the first year that I am really seriously ready for it. The past two mornings now I've woke up feeling quite cold. The air just feels a little bit crispier and Autumn's fast approaching and I'm here for it. I actually really am. Number one thing to do on my list today is go to Starbucks and get a pumpkin spice latte because if you have been on my channel for a long time, you will know I haven't ever had a pumpkin spice latte. Two years ago I did a vlog and it included me going to get one and it had stopped being served. So we have to do that today. Also, I want to give you an update on the house. I want to go to TK Maxx today. This is sort of the whole vibe of the house at the minute. We have lots of boxes everywhere. If you didn't know, we are moving house soon. I mean, we still haven't yet got the keys, but yesterday I got home from work and Alex and his dad had boxed up so much stuff. But I have to have a coffee in the morning in a specific cup and I can't find it. So we're nipping to TK Maxx now before Lenny's nap. 10 now quarter to nine isn't it i wanted i have got such a busy day today that's why i've sort of picked up the camera today i like to do it on a day where we've got loads on like i mentioned we are moving house soon so i've got to just get really organized and somebody is actually coming to view our house at four o'clock today but i have a lash lift appointment at quarter past four so it's going to be alex showing them round. so i literally need the house spotless it ain't gonna be that spotless because we're moving, so there's literally boxes and stuff everywhere, but I just feel like I need to do a spring clean when he goes down for a nap. But that's normally when I get ready, so how ready I'll be today is, you know, I'm not sure. I really want to go over the top this year with like all the autumnal stuff, all the Halloween vibes. Obviously, every year for me now is just gonna be more and more special the older that Lenny gets, so I just really want to make it special. <laughs> I'm just so excited for this period of time, like <clears throat> I'm just never that bothered but I am this year, I'm just ready for the cold weather, I mean it's 14 degrees now and it's only quarter to nine so it's probably going to be warm by this afternoon but I'm getting into the autumnal vibes, you guys are going to be feeling autumnal after this video, so let's see what's at TK Max. Right guys, they have the biggest range of Halloween stuff, it's so nice, I'm going to show you. Hi. All these, which are adorable. And they have the cutest cushions and like tea towels and stuff. I mean, that's just candle heaven, isn't it? So many to choose from. This is my favourite part though. How stunning. And wreaths are just next level. Hello, cutie. Okay, we are back from TK Maxx. So I want to quickly show you what we picked up. And here comes the little man himself. Hello, dude. You really need a haircut, you know? You actually do. So on Wednesdays, I normally like to... Are you tired? Yeah. Don't mind him being in his baby girl still. It's actually nearly dinner time. But Lenny has a nap, like, 10 out of 10 for a good hour and a bit. So we don't really get him changed till after his lunch. Um, yeah, so on Wednesdays, I normally like to get quite a lot of content done. Oh, look, mummy found a chicken. So I usually put my makeup on on a Wednesday and try and look half alive, unlike the rest of the week. But today, I'm actually getting my LVL done because my lashes look like they're non-existent now because the lash lift that I had for my holiday is gone now. Okay, so let's talk about talk about what we've picked up so if you have me on tiktok you will see how much stuff they had in um i think i filmed a little bit on the camera but i don't think i filmed as much as i did for my tiktok so go and check that out because honestly tk maxx had so much stuff in i'm always impressed with how much tk maxx have in around like christmas halloween obviously they always have so many candles and stuff but the halloween section this year 
all the different pumpkins and everything. It was just incredible. I picked these up. Don't know if we're going to get any use out of them. These were $4.99. But they are so cute. Black and white little mini pumpkins. Oh, why does everything have to go in your mouth? Obviously, because we're not in the new house yet, it's so hard to actually plan what I'm going to have in there. Obviously, I have, I have so many Pinterest boards. But it's actually really, really hard to visualise what I'll actually put in there. So I just picked a few bits up and hopefully I'll get to use them at some point. I got a huge vase because this was in the reduced section for £8. I mean, again, I'm not 100% sure what I'll do with this. I'm thinking maybe in our bedroom we could do some nice tall pampas grass or something. I don't know. I'm not really sure what vibe I want in the bedroom yet. I'm really torn. I know what colour scheme, but I'm not 100% on the... Um, on the vibe <clears throat> shall we show everybody your halloween costume yeah we picked up lenny's halloween costume wow do you yeah. like it right i've literally got the dog lenny while i'm trying to show everybody what we got this was 9.99 and they had so many available of these so i'm sure most tk maxes will have lots of these available but i just can't cope if you watched if you've been on my channel for a while you will know last halloween he was a pumpkin let me find a picture so this was lenny last year on halloween <laughs> so this year he's gonna be a bigger version i'm gonna have to dress him as a pumpkin for the foreseeable just to like compare all the pictures i picked up a halloween it's not a halloween it's more just like a well, it is Halloween candle because it says spooky, but I felt like this was quite autumnal. And this is this is a spiced pumpkin and clove candle. And finally, I picked up a mug. This is a witch's brew. Alex will be like, "That's the perfect mug for you." And this was three ninety nine, and it's huge, so I can have a nice big cup of coffee in the morning in this. I'm going to really try and be good at collecting my mugs for the foreseeable because I went through a phase of loving mugs. I got like Christmas ones, elf ones, like for matching for me and Alex. So now I'm going to try and regain lots of new mugs in the new house because I just seem to have lost loads of mugs. Lenny, show everybody your new trolley. Alex had a day off yesterday and he took him toy shopping and look at that. Show everybody. Instead of pushing it round, he just likes to bang it around. So yeah, that's what I picked up from TK Maxx. Could have picked up so much more, but you know, gotta watch the pennies now that we're moving house, because there's lots to do in the new house. And I have decided, I wasn't actually gonna do this, but I am actually gonna document the move. I'm gonna document, um, if I remember, each room renovation, because it literally is a full renovation top to bottom. And yeah, I'm gonna take you guys along with me for the journey of, you know, revamping the house. And yeah, it's exciting. I literally knew this was gonna happen. So it's now 22 degrees and it's roasting. Do I fancy a pumpkin spice latte in the warmth? No, but I really want to try one. I'm gonna see what iced stuff they have in, like see if they've got any new iced coffees available and then I'll try them. And then in another vlog, I will try a pumpkin spice latte eventually. I'm really not in the mood for coffee. This is pure commitment for YouTube because I'm only having one to see. <laughs> to let you all know what they taste like. Hi, have you got the pumpkin cream cold brew in? Uh, yeah, we do. Yeah, could I try that please? Yeah, yeah. Yes, please. Yes, please. Can I get a water as well, please? Uh, tap water will be fine, thank you. That's everything, thanks. Thank you. Right team, so I actually have given this a good shake, so it wasn't combined, but now it is. And I've already tried it because I've just, done it. I've just filmed a TikTok. It's actually really nice. It's not like, I mean, I don't really know what pumpkin tastes like, but it wouldn't, it's not overpowering or anything. It just gives it a sweet and flavor and it's really nice. I would recommend. Right, I've just come to get my lash lift, LBL eyelash lift, same thing. Uh, so just thought I'd show you a quick before. Literally I feel like all you can see is my eyelid. Like you can just see so much of this part. So I'm excited just to get that nice lift back. So 
I will show you when they're done. I've just been sat editing and I realised I didn't show you an after of my lashes, so... Wow. <sighs> how insane. Like, how insane. Good morning, guys. I didn't close the vlog off yesterday. I was actually only going to do, like, a day in the life sort of vlog. I normally only do them over one day, but this has actually gone over two days. You saying good morning? No? Yeah. Hi. My face yeah. is full of porridge. I've just nipped upstairs to quickly put my camera on charge because we are nipping to Asta this morning. We're just going to see if there's any new closing because obviously we are now in September. Happy September, guys. And I also just wanted to quickly tell you about this jumper while I picked up the camera. So I probably could have done with giving it a little iron, but this is not the time to iron. I do not have time to iron. So this is... Let me turn you back around. I just wanted to quickly show you on this angle. This sweatshirt is from My Racking Kids, which I am a brand ambassador for. I absolutely love My Racking Kids. They have the most insane collections. They're very, very personalised, so they're amazing for mum and sons, mum and daughters, the whole family, dads and their children. But this in particular is from the Mama Lounge range. Now, this collection... what I was saying this is from the Mama Lounge collection and this collection is my personal ever favorite this sweatshirt is like almost waffle material it's absolutely stunning love the color it's very comfy it's quite thick so it's going to be good for autumn winter so yeah I wanted to let you all know that I actually have a discount code if you want to go and check anything out on the Mara and Kids website I will obviously pop the link below and my discount code is Chloe Kane underscore and that will get you 20% off the whole site so go and have a nose it there is loads to choose from they've now got the Christmas PJs out for the whole family they've got Halloween stuff so go and check them out I am well aware how bitty this vlog has been and I'm sorry okay I am sorry but it's now Sunday my lips are on fire because I have just applied Plumpet that I have to tell you all about. Okay, so I now work with the brand Plumpet, which is insane. I am so proud of myself, so like grateful to Plumpet for you know allowing me to be a part of the team and to promote the product. You know, it's such a huge thing for me, it really, really is. So I wanted to show you like how good the results are. Obviously, this has only just been applied, and you can already see how much my top lip is beginning to plump so it does tingle a little bit you know i'm not gonna lie but it is so worth the pain you know pain is beauty as they say and i just find when i've done my makeup like i have today when i use plump it i can just apply my lip liner and my lipstick so much easier oh they are currently on fire obviously you can purchase plump it through the plump it site on its own or i do have it on my tiktok shop so you know if you want to go and support your gal head over to my tiktok shop and purchase it through that yeah just it's like just sat here now talking about that it's just very it's overwhelming really because i'm so happy that i now can say i work with three different brands you know to some that i'd be like she only works with three but to me, that is just huge, like absolutely huge. I could never have imagined six months ago, even like when I started my YouTube channel, like two, three years ago, that I would now be a brand ambassador for brands. I would be, you know, filming content that is paid content. It's just insane. Anyway, but before I go too deep, Lenny's just woke up from his nap, I can hear him on the monitor. But yeah, I'm just really grateful for where I am and obviously, I'm only doing what I'm doing because of you guys. Like, obviously people have to view your stuff and watch your stuff and support you through, you know, like something as simple as TikTok shop. I wouldn't be getting what I'm getting without you guys. So yeah, I'm just very, very grateful. So yeah. Did you have a nice sleep? <laughs> oh goodness. Right, why do you keep waking up with wet hair? I don't understand, that must be sweat. <laughs> 
look like the devil. You don't need your doody. Oh, goodness. Right, Mummy's just um, been telling everybody about plumpet that I put on my lips. Moody Margaret. Anyway, we've got a fun day planned today, you know, Lenny. I haven't told you yet what we're doing today. We are going to a fun... Okay. See ya. Well, I'll tell you guys. So we're going to a place called Guy's Thatched Hamlet, which is about 40 minutes from where we live. And um, they've got like a... I think it's like a seafood and oyster festival, which is perfect for us because we love seafood. But today, as it's Sunday, they also have a family fun day on. So there's hopefully going to be something for Lenny to do as well. We just hate staying in on a Sunday afternoon. Like, even though the weather's a bit gloomy and it is outside, I feel like it's good to get out. And Lenny hates being in the house all day, so we have to get out. So that's where we're going. I'm going to take you guys along with us. And then actually, this vlog might be half decent. Okay, so we've come up to... So we don't even know if the seafood festival is on, but we're going to have a look. Right, it's actually so quiet. music now so you can hear me. I thought the oysters were a 10 out of 10. What did you think? Um, yeah, 10. You didn't like them as much as me. I thought it was really good. I would say they are a better version of mussels. Your face said you didn't like them really. <laughs> Ask Lenny how they are. Mm. Lenny didn't try them. Did. No, he didn't. Uh, and then we had a fish platter which was really good. Although it was a bit um, greasy. Fishy. No, obviously it's fishy. <laughs> no, it was a bit greasy. We're gonna go and have a look at the fun fair now, see if there's anything for Lenny to go on, but he's actually due a nap now, so I don't think he'll be up to going on anything. That is gonna go ahead and finish this little catch-up vlog. Let me just grab a seat so the camera isn't all over the place. I feel like I always sit here for like closing vlogs, but Lenny is behind me playing with cardboard boxes because what child doesn't love a cardboard box? I'm gonna end on a positive note. We hopefully are getting the keys this coming week. So that means the moving vlogs can begin, the renovation vlogs can begin. I am excited because I feel like there's so much content that can be made and you know, I'll take you guys along with us and yeah, I'm, I'm feeling a little bit emotional, I'm not gonna lie, like moving from this house which really does feel like home is a big thing. It really, really is. I just definitely feel like we've outgrown this space now. We are ready for a little bit of a bigger property. Um, the one we're moving into is still only a two bed. Obviously lots of plans, which I'll save for the next vlog. I hope you enjoyed the little catch up vlog. It's been lovely to pick up the camera again and I'm sure this is the start of lots of uploads to come. I love you guys so much. I appreciate you all and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.